friends, this is Carmen with you today, and I wanted to share with you an update on some of the plants that I have either propagated or newly bought. As you probably remember from a previous video, this is my San Pedro cactus. This is the mother plant that I um, cut into three separate pieces, and it's already growing some little nodules there and getting new arms. This is the middle section here of the plant that I had cut and I know that it's already taking root because it's already getting a little nodule, a little arm there that's starting to grow. The top portion of the plant I've given to my son and that's doing fine also. But both of the pieces have taken root beautifully. These are some aeoniums that I had purchased. Um, this is aeonium sunburst I purchased at Rogers Gardens in Newport Beach, California, my recent trip. This is the aeonium cyclops that I got through Etsy, actually, and they're doing wonderful. Right now, in the um, winter time, it is their growing season. They're coming out of dormancy. And this is the other aeonium I got at Rogers Gardens, the aeonium sword cop. And it did shed a few leaves, they kind of dried up and, and fell off, but they were all towards the bottom of the plant. It's um, growing beautifully, it's starting to get new leaves in the center, and it's really um, doing well now in um, at coming out of dormancy and getting settled in this new pot that I put it in. Now, the Thanksgiving cactus that I had purchased at California Cactus Center, um, it did lose all of its um, flowers and buds, but it's getting new growth and that little pink uh, stub right there, that is a new flower bud that it's getting. So um, I learned my lesson not to repot these when they are blooming, but it's recovering beautifully. The Sechveria nodulosa is doing wonderful also. It's getting a little bit stretched out. Um, I think it's just looking for some sun but it's doing fine. And this potted plant here is the Senecio Jacobsonii, and it's variegated. It's actually tricolored. It does have some pink in it, and it's doing wonderful in this hanging basket. I do kind of need to adjust the cocoa liner there because when I water, some of the water does run off, but otherwise it's taking root beautifully and it's getting new growth every day, so it's doing wonderful. But one surprise that I got this week was my split rock split and it's getting a new little growth inside there. It never flowered or anything. It just started splitting and the new growth started going. I'm not watering it. I'm letting it just kind of grow and um, on its own and it's doing wonderful along with the other split rock and lift ups in this little dish. Thanks so much for joining me today, friends. Have a blessed day.